Don't you hate it when you are casually surfing the web and on every site you visit are constantly bombarded with advertisements and pop-ups? What's even more alarming is that these ads are specifically tailored to your browsing history. And the more you search, the more these ads learn about you. That's because the companies marketing to you have targeted you as a potential customer because they have access to your personal information and surfing habits. But don't worry, you are not defenseless. By installing an ad blocker, you are effectively eliminating these sponsored ads from popping up while browsing the internet and blocking companies from tracking and selling your information. That means no more ads for daintycandles.com showing up in your search results. No more sponsored cute puppy clickbait ads taking you to a site trying to sell you the next muscle enhancing pills. And no more annoying 15 second ads showing up smack dab in the middle of a 10 second Facebook video posted by your mother-in-law sharing the newest addition to her garden gnome collection. Believe it or not, installing an ad blocker is not just about blocking ads or protecting your privacy, but securing your personal devices from malicious attacks. Attackers are now buying up online ad space and loading them with malware that can cause major harm to your devices. When you click on one of these malicious ads, software is installed on your computer in the background without you knowing, and may do anything from deleting files tracking your keystrokes to steal your usernames and passwords, or even scouring your hard drive for credit card and financial information, and sending it back to the attackers where they sell it on the dark web. When it comes to ad blockers, the bottom line is pretty simple. Either you're tired of being bombarded by ads, or like me, you want to secure your devices and take back your privacy by preventing companies from knowing that you are in the market for a Nicolas Cage shower curtain. It's important to keep in mind that while ad blockers are built to remove ads from your online experience, they do not block them 100% of the time. In fact, companies often pay ad blocking developers to whitelist their ads, preventing them from being blocked. Your one minute mission this episode is simple. Do some research on ad blockers by Googling best ad blockers and choose a website reviewer like Consumer Reports, Macworld, or PC Magazine that you know and trust. What you will find is that each ad blocker is effective at different things. Some are for a specific browser, others work only on mobile, and a few of the more popular ones are able to block ads across all of your devices. And then actually install the ad blocker on your computer and your mobile device as well. You won't just be safer, you'll appreciate getting rid of all of those inappropriate ads often connected to malware that waste your time. And here at Cilio on Security, we love making you safer while saving time. Thanks so much, I'll see you next time.